Student loan forgiveness was last week's headline and scammers trying to cash in on that news is this week's warning. Tiffany Craig has tips on how to protect yourself. Unsolicited calls, texts, emails, and phony websites. That's how scammers will use the news about student loan forgiveness to bait victims. Whether it is additional benefits, faster benefits, erasing your student debt, all of those are empty promises that will lead to an empty pocketbook. The Better Business Bureau is bracing for a spike in calls and reports after the Federal Trade Commission issued a consumer alert about the potential for a new batch of scams. It's important to know that the government is not allowed to call you about your student loan unless you've given permission. Which is why the BBB has five tips to help you protect yourself. First, understand that these government programs are free to sign up. It's a red flag if someone offers help for a fee. Number two, know the ins and outs of your student loan. That way you don't fall for it if a scammer promises benefits the government or your loan provider hasn't already offered. Number three, do your research. Look up the lender or company reaching out to you to find out if that's a scam artist on the other end of the line. Number four, look before you click. The BBB says some imposters create lookalike government websites, so pay attention to that URL. And finally, protect your private data. Don't give out your social security number, federal student aid ID, or any other personal information. Tiffany Craig, KHOU 11 News.